All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for today, and I'm here to take a look at the announcement trailer for Cypher 007, which, of course, this is the, the game from the Hitman guys. Finally, we're going to see it. It's looking a little weird. Look at him. He looks like, he looks, he looks like, I'm assuming that's supposed to be James Bond. I don't, it's 007, I would assume so. He kind of looks like him, I guess. He looks like, he's like, you just plucked a like a guy from the PS2 era up Resdom, and now it looks like he's he's like trying not to shit his pants. So what's <laughs> happening? He's just like, <laughs> he's like, I can't hear you. Please help me. <laughs> oh, please no. Oh, oh. <laughs> Let's check this. Out. I have no idea what it is. Well, no, that's not true. I I think I know. And here, I'll just show real quick. I'm trying not to look. Because there's a description there. Here you go. Can you see it? Do I have the... Can you see my mouse? <laughs> Whatever. I'm just going to scroll back up. Uh, so yeah, there's a... It, you know what? A little bit more even than I would expect considering... Um, considering the... Uh, uh, that it's definitely a mobile game. <laughs> so let's get to it. It's 100% mobile game. Maybe it's like not a bad one. Let's find out. 3, 2, 1, play. James. Bond, name James. James name. Somebody call a bunch of it. <laughs> oh. Wait, maybe this isn't a mobile game. Oh, no, it's a mobile game. <laughs> I thought maybe it was going to be like a... Okay, this actually doesn't look bad. What the hell? Okay. It reminds me of that... Bam, 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 Oh, Blofeld. I'm zooming. I, I didn't see a scar, but whatever. Maybe it's Dr. Evil. All right, September 29th. Yep, arcade. Uh, I was like, wait, hold on. The graphics are looking pretty good, but then I have, I have to keep reminding myself, like, graphics are looking pretty good on the phone. Actually, they've been looking good. Remember Infinity Blade? That, that game, when it came out, I want to know what that game looks like now. Holy shit, I didn't even think about that game until right now. I want to see what Infinity Blade looks like. Um, I guess just gameplay. Uh, let's see. Uh, I want. I know. I want. I want. Um, original. Oh, there's lore. What the fuck? Um, here we go. Yeah, I want the original version. I want to see because I remember that game blowing my mind. Dude, this game still looks good already. Look. This game, you had to have the fucking beefiest iPhone at the time. Dude, it looks, it, it still looks really good for an iPhone game. What the fuck? It's been over 10 years. Yeah. Chair also made uh, Shadow Complex, which was an amazing movie. I mean, game. It would make a pretty good movie, too. Uh, but it was not a movie. It was a game. Uh, all right. Hey, hey, this looks like uh, what I was going to say at first, but then I realized you, you're you're actually walking yourself, which I don't think you do in this game. Uh, it reminded me of that one John Wick game. Uh, well, I guess the only one that exists. Uh, Hex. I think there might... Isn't there like a VR game or something for John Wick that came out? And like... like I don't think people cared for it. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. I think there was a John Wick VR game. Hold on. I'm, I want to see now. Hold on. John Wick VR game. Uh, John Wick Chronicles. Yeah, there you go. That's the one I was thinking of. Uh, is an immersive first person shooter built from the ground up for virtual reality. Uh, I'm assuming that's out. I remember seeing gameplay for a John Wick game. It could have been a mod, I guess, to be fair. Uh, I just saw, I saw gameplay like a few years ago. Anyway, point is, is that, uh, it, I thought it looked like that. It, it's not quite that because you're controlling your character. I don't think in John Wick Hex you do. Don't you have, like, it's more like a strategy game. Maybe you do control. It, it also reminds me a little bit of, like, Midnight Fight Express, which I play a little bit of with the combat a little bit. It, this could be decent, especially if it has, like, Hitman-ish qualities. This is exactly what I expect from the Hitman, um... Is it IOI? Is that their name? Um, and that's exactly what I expect from the Hitman guys. Something like this. It, it, I really, honestly, that 007 game, if it's just literally 007, or uh, I'm sorry, if it's literally Hitman with a 007 skin, I think that would be perfect. Like, well, honestly, think about it. Like, that's that's the kind of shit that I love. 
from 007 when he like infiltrates a place like he's not normally assassinating people i mean he is but like that's not like the main that's you know it's not like hitman i mean hitman literally his whole point is he's a hitman i don't know if you realize that in the title hitman that means he kills people um where 007 doesn't normally do that but they could totally work it around like oh he has to go here he has to find blowfield he has to do this to capture this capture that kill this you know so they could really change it up and uh yeah, I'm actually excited for that game. Dude, if they if they got, like, Obsidian to do a 007 game and they just gave them the budget to do one, they would be able to blow it out of the water. You know why? Because Alpha Protocol, if anybody remembers that game, look it up. Gameplay-wise, it's not great, but everything else is awesome about that game. I don't care what anybody says. The music is excellent. The story's great. Character's great. The writing's great. The story, like evolves and devolves as you go and make choices so many different choices like i don't know what the fuck happened with the gameplay there because like obsidian made some good games with great gameplay around that, that time and they make way better games now i guess when it comes to gameplay but um it's very strange because that that game could have been amazing if the gameplay was good the gameplay was not good everything about it was amazing if the gameplay was awesome too or at least competent people would be like hell yeah alpha protocol i still thought i, I still think about it. i still really like that game um anyway so cypher 007 i'm just saying like i think they could nail it well at least in story and all that stuff and yeah anyway that's it cypher 007 hey, hey i'm not gonna shit on it just because it's a mobile game i know some people will but it looks like it could be pretty good who knows who knows